Hi, this is Linda Sherman, at Linda Sherman on Twitter, and I'm here with Kevin Nalty, at Naltz on Twitter. And Kevin is the author of a wonderful book called Beyond Viral. And I would love for you to tell our viewers something about what they can do in the video space to help their small businesses. Yeah, sure. You know, a lot of a lot of uh, brands uh, or small companies want to go viral, like the big, you know, viral hits. But if you think about it, most of the viral videos that you, you that you know of now are not commercials. So it's really it's become increasingly difficult to get a video seen by four or five million, which is my definition now, viral. So the better approach is to work with people that are already talking to your target audience. So, you know, if you're selling athletic apparel, go to somebody that's already garnered a group of people that are athletic enthusiasts and work with them. And uh, they're, most of them are eager to be sponsored. They're happy to, for a marginal amount of money, you know, work you into the show, which is, to me, far more effective than trying to produce your own content, seed it, get a lot of views, and it's a lot more endearing than insertion ads that pop up, you know, on the bottom of the video, so. Great. Now you yourself have amazing following on YouTube. Can, can you talk about how you got yourself made like yeah. that? I was, uh, I was bored as a J&J &J, uh, innovation guy and uh, started to create videos. And now, like almost a thousand videos later, I've got a couple hundred thousand people that are subscribed and 170 million views, um, but it took a lot of time, you know, so that's one thing I urge, uh, you know, businesses to consider is that, you know, it may not be the, you know, one video that pops. Like, I throw a lot of videos out there, and, you know, some of them go crazy, some of them don't. Um, so it just takes a lot of persistence. And, and the other thing, too, is, you know, you really can't promote without making it entertaining first. And so as a marketer, you know, a former marketer, it's hard to kind of let the, the brand message take a back seat, but it has to. It's got to be entertaining and interesting or clever uh, before it's promotional. So that's the advantage in working with somebody who's figured out how to do it. Yeah, because they know their audience, so they know what they can get away with, and they're credentialed, you know, so it's a little bit like hiring a spokesperson. You know, their, their fans like them. They know how to speak to their fa fans, and they'll work your message in, you know, without making it feel too, you know, intrusive. Great. Well, thank you so much, Kevin. I really cool. appreciate your time today. My pleasure.